Oh, Psalm 138, let's go. Lord, I will praise you with all my heart in front of those who think they are gods. I will sing praise to you. I will bow down facing your holy temple. I will praise your name because you are loving and faithful. You have honored your name and your word more than anything else. When I called out to you, you answered me. You made me strong and brave. Lord, may all of the kings on earth praise you when they hear about what you have promised. Lord, may they sing about what you have done because your glory is great. The Lord is in heaven, but he watches over those who are free of pride. He knows those who are proud and stays far away from them. Troubles is, trouble is all around me, but you keep me alive. You reach out your hand to put a stop to the anger of my enemies. With your powerful right hand, you save me. Lord, you will do everything you have planned for me. Lord, your faithful love continues forever. You have done so much for us. Don't stop now. Psalm 139. Lord, you have seen what is in my heart. You know all about me. You know when I sit down and when I get up. You know what I'm thinking even though you're far away. You know when I go out to work and when I come back home. You know exactly how I live, Lord, even before I speak a word. You know all about it. You are all around me. You are behind me and in front of me. You hold me in your power. I'm amazed how well you know me. It's more than I can understand. How can I get away from your spirit? Where can I go to escape from you? If I go up to the heavens, you are there. If I lie down in the deepest parts of the earth, you are also there. Suppose I were to rise with the sun in the east and then cross over into the west where it sinks into the ocean. Your hand would always be there to guide me. Your right hand would still be holding me close. Suppose I were to say, I'm sure the darkness will hide me. The light around me will become as dark as night. Even that darkness would not be dark to you. The night would shine like the day because darkness is like light to you. You created the deepest parts of my being. You put me together inside my mother's body. How you made me is amazing and wonderful. I praise you for that. What you have done is wonderful. I know that very well. None of my bones was hidden from you when you made me inside my mother's body. That place was as dark as the deepest part of the earth when you were putting me together there. Your eyes saw my body even before it was formed. You planned how many days I would live. You wrote down the number of them in your book before I had lived through even one of them. God, your thoughts about me are priceless. No one can possibly add them all up. If I could count them, they would be more than the grains of sand. If I were to fall asleep counting and then wake up, you would still be there with me. God, I wish you would kill the people who are evil. I wish those murderers would get away from me. They are your enemies. They misuse your name. They misuse it for their own evil purposes. Lord, I really hate those who hate you. I really hate those who rise up against you. I have nothing but hatred for them. I consider them to be my enemies. God, see what is in my heart. Know what is there. Put me to the test. Know what I'm thinking. See if there's anything in my life you don't like. Help me live in the way that is always right. Wow. I could just like read this over and over, like just, just read them all. It's, it's really beautiful and they're almost like timeless prayers that just are like so heavy and I especially like the Psalms because a lot of times they're like singing this devotional prayer instead of like um, a personal cry for help. It's very, very beautiful. Wow. These Psalms of David are very powerful. I just came across Psalm 143 and Psalm 144. Very, very powerful. Very, very powerful. Great, great book. Thank you for spending time with me. It's been so fun. Oh, ho.